Hey guys, we just finished with the UI review. Now we'll be going ahead and uh, run some benchmark tests and see how the phone performs. See how the hardware, the Scorpion processor is working on this phone. Okay, I have the benchmark test, standard ben quadrant benchmark installed on my phone. Just run it. Okay, uh, before I do that, I'll just kill all the applications so that there's no, no hindrance and okay, we get the proper results for this benchmark okay okay there we have a quadrant standard this is the first time I've seen such a small score I have this phone from a week powered on haven't uh, restarted a phone yet so if you find some performance issues you can restart phone once in three days or once in a week once in a week is longer once in three days should give you a very good result okay uh, there you see score is 1453 and we can just run another score, another te same test. We can run another time and see how well this it performs this time. Okay, and now again we have the score of 1650 as a score is between 1000 it's, uh, it's around 1700 so now we have scored 1654 okay uh, we have NeoCore also installed on the phone just run it and see how GPU performs on this phone Yeah, and this returns a result of 60.5 frames per second that's the GPU test results okay that's about the benchmark test on this phone I don't have uh, any other benchmark test that could be run okay we'll just uh, go and quickly see how the gaming of is performed in this particular phone.
okay so to see better results I'll just kill all the tasks and make sure that nothing else is eating up all the memory on this phone okay, I have all the tasks killed and now okay uh, I may not say that this is my favorite but this is one game that I have it installed and I don't know working I have Shrek card 2 but I don't want to show you that game it's not that good of graphics and on that game okay we'll just start Assassin's Creed and see how this game play is on this phone Just skip the intro video for now. I'll just go with the game. Okay, the video is done. The game installed and running. Okay. I wonder why the Templars are attacking this village. This is a bit boring part of the game. I'll just restart this mission and see how some actions. It's fun. Just wanted to show how good the graphics is and the gameplay is on this phone. Okay, there we are. Where did you come from? The sound, the sound of the game is like very clear on the phone. It's like very good experience when you're playing with full volume on this game. You feel as if you're playing on a very hi-fi, high-end gaming device. You don't feel that it's just a mobile that you're playing the game on. Really, the gaming is a work. It's pleasure on this phone. Okay, we are back to the same boring part of this game. Okay. I wonder why the Templars are attacking this village. Okay, that's about some nonsense conversation. Enough! I don't know much. Our captain was under orders. To find a man that Lord Basil... Just come back to some more action. Okay, oh, I've just lost the path. Now I need to go all the way back.
Okay, I'm back to the same part again. Okay, that's about the gaming on this device. If you want, I can show you now the game. That's a, I have Splinter Cell also installed on this phone. I can just quickly. I'm just resetting my profile so that I can show you the beginning of the game. Just skip this video for now. Just go to the game gaming part of this phone. Just skip another video. Okay, the game blows pretty fast. Okay, the game begins in a set of dark background. That's what I've seen in this phone. You start at a dock oh, in the night. Me. Give me a little credit, Sam. Don't tell me you don't recognize my voice even after all this time. Grim, what do you want? To save your life. We can go from there. A team of armed men just entered the marketplace. Okay, I'll just skip another video. Just get in action. Okay, I found a gun. I'm applying this post. I got them killed.
Okay guys, that's about the gaming on this device. I just hope that uh, all the questions that you had about this phone is solved now and you can make your decisions on whether you need to buy this phone or not. Uh, one thing that I've not covered is the camera quality and I tell you the camera for 5 megapixel the clarity is not so good as I've already told you but uh, the default app doesn't perform well because there's a lot of compression that happens on the photograph that you've clicked by the default app but if you can download some camera apps like I've tested uh, on a camera 360 app from the market uh, the image size the image size is pretty big and also the lot of details that is covered so you can just uh, go ahead buy the phone and then if you're not satisfied with the default camera app you can just install one of those apps and get a very good performance with the camera too so that's about the phone and any more queries you can just post in your comments thanks guys thanks a lot